Hi, CLD Nation. The journey towards uh, cross-cultural performance mastery and developing awareness is ongoing. So I'm going to share a story with you of something that happened just last night where uh, I lacked awareness. Uh, so this is Brian Rose and I'm starting to figure out how to do vlogs and, and maybe how to do podcasts. So I'm taking this Broadcast Yourself workshop. And one of the challenges in this workshop is I have to list people that I want to interview. So for my video, I listed Gary V or Gary Vaynerchuk as one of the people that I want to interview. And I made this video in which I was kind of impersonating Gary, but I was explaining Gary V in Chinese to a Chinese audience. And as I was uh, trying to share this video through social media, I made a mistake that I knew was a mistake, but I didn't become aware of it till about five hours later, and then I rectified it. So what did I do? I started tagging people. Now, originally, my intention was just to tag a couple people that I knew in China that I used to work with that might be interested in me making a video uh, talking about Gary Vee. But then I also started tagging other influencers that I either follow or admire, and, and that was probably not a good idea. Um, so I immediately uh, deleted the tags of everybody, and I sent a personal message to the three people that I brought into this conversation, uh, sent them an apology, and now I'm gonna do this video that uh, kind of demonstrating where uh, I am learning from this experience. Now vlogging is new for me and intuitively I know that you shouldn't just tag people and try to bring them into your conversation so you can promote your social media and this is an experience where I am learning. So I'm sharing this experience with you so hopefully you can take your own experiences where perhaps you make a poor decision and then learn and grow from that. So the people that I brought into this conversation, one was uh, Sean Rain. So I want to give a. I'm reading this book that he wrote, The War for China's Wallet, and it's an excellent book. He starts off really by a framework where he talks about nations that are building relationships with China in terms of hot, warm, and cold. And I had just recently had a conversation with Sean, who was very gracious. He he made a post talking about checks and balances, and, and I asked him a question, and he basically replied to me faster than I replied to him. And then as I was thinking about China, uh, I just naturally just brought him into my post, which was a mistake. So I apologize to him, and I want to give his book a little bit of a, a shout out because I think it's an excellent read. Another influencer who I, also brought into this conversation, which I uh, actually I learned from Josh Steinle. I've taken his uh, masterclass, Power Publishing Masterclass, on kind of how to become an influencer and how to connect with other people. And Josh actually teaches us that you want to make sure you deliver value to the people you want to try to connect with and not just bring them into your own conversation. So uh, Josh is based in Shenzhen. So when I was doing this vlog about China, I also naturally thought about him and I said, well, I want Josh to see this. But uh, probably what I shouldn't have done is just tagged him on the post. Uh, I could have sent him a private message and said, hey, John, Josh, can you take a look at this? But anyway, Josh is one of also the people who I consider one of my mentors. Uh, and, and basically, you just need to read his blogs uh, and teach you how to become an influencer how to promote yourself on LinkedIn, how to improve your LinkedIn profile. Um, anyway, Josh has been great as a mentor to me, and again, made a mistake last night, and um, I just wanted to share this experience with uh, CLD Nation. Uh, the third person I brought into this is Jason Inch. So I have also read his book. Uh, he's written several books about social entrepreneurship. He's based in China. He's a adjunct economics professor at Shanghai Jiao Tong University. Uh, he runs one of the best 
meetup platforms in Shanghai, China business events, and he's invited me to be a keynote uh, on his platform, which I'm very gracious of. And his latest book is about China 4.0. And if you want to really understand how China has transitioned from over the last 40 years, and especially now that uh, Xi Jinping has kind of changed China's constitution where he could be the indefinite leader indefinitely. Uh, if you really want to understand China, uh, Jason is, is, is really somebody that, that I'm friends with and I admire and that I follow. So again, for, for this video, it's just about self-awareness and uh, I made a mistake. I brought people into a conversation who are influencers and just maybe subconsciously hoping that them seeing my post would help share it, uh, but that's really not the right approach. And especially the video that I made was about Gary V, and Gary V definitely would not agree with that approach. So um, I'm owning up to my mistake. I'm sharing this experience with um, CLD Nation, which is a very, very small group now that I'm trying to grow about really just developing the essential soft skills, which is awareness and empathy, and applying them at the intersection of doing business in China or doing business across cultures.